Hello, my name is Paul Hunt and I am a typeface designer and font developer at Adobe. Well, I think uh, there is very good education around developing non-Latin typefaces uh, and hopefully most people who uh, kind of embark on that effort in these days will try to make sure that each writing system kind of retains its own character. Uh, I think that the real drawback uh, currently for non-Latin typeface design is just that uh, there are so few fonts for writing systems other than Latin. Uh, so I hope that within the next decade that that will continue to change and we'll start to see more and more different uh, and innovative type styles uh, coming on the market for writing systems other than the Latin script. I think uh, to be able to have uh, excellence in terms of design, a typeface designer needs to first educate themselves about the writing system that they're designing type for uh, and try to make sure that they understand uh, that they know how the writing system works. Uh, and also they need to try to familiarize themselves with the the calligraphic traditions, uh, the manuscript traditions, the different uh, traditions that inform uh, how the writing system is shaped uh, so that you can get things right like uh, like uh, proportion, the internal uh, system of proportions uh, within a given writing system. Well, I mean, that's, uh, it's kind of a balancing act. Um, you need to know how the writing system works, but also you need to be able to have some, some talent or some skill in uh, designing typefaces. Uh, so I don't think you can really have one without the other when you're making a typeface, uh, a good typeface for any script, that, whether it's Latin or a uh, non-Latin script. You need to have both the knowledge of how the writing system works, uh, as well as uh, you need to have skill uh, in designing letter forms for that particular writing system. I think that's a tough question. Uh, because we, in the West, we do use the Latin script, and uh, much of our type culture kind of uh, sprung up in the West. I think it is uh, hard for us to think about non-Latin uh, typeface design and development in terms of uh, something besides being something that is other. Uh, I, I myself struggle with the terminology non-Latin because it kind of just feels like a, a big uh, like catch-all and it does feel very other. Um, I think that uh, there is some, there can be some better terminology in, in how to refer to these writing systems, uh, but I'm not sure what that would be yet.